Yeah, Jackie and Johnny, police tell us they believe his body was inside that container for a day, day and a half before he was found tonight. Investigators tell us his death has been ruled a homicide. A shocking discovery in West Philadelphia after police find the body of a 12 year old boy now identified as Hezekiah Bernard. He was brutal, brutally killed and placed in a trash can. Philadelphia police say it was last Tuesday, August 22nd, when a Housing Authority sanitation worker picked up a trash container from the 5500 block of Cherry Street and took it to a nearby storage facility where it was housed overnight. On August the 23rd, that same PHA employee drove the sanitation truck with the container back to the 5500 block of Cherry Street to gather more trash. During the drive, the container overturned and the remains of a male were observed inside that container with a plastic wrapped around the head with a comforter over him. Staff Inspector Ernest Ransom, who leads the city's homicide unit, says an autopsy shows the boy, who was unidentified at the time, was shot in the head. Several attempts were made to identify the decedent by the Philadelphia Department of Records and Identification Unit, along with the medical examiner's office. That yielded negative results. Ransom says they got their first break in the case two days ago, nearly a week after the discovery, when family members were made aware and were able to positively identify the boy. But still, many questions remain. The focus of this investigation is the swift apprehension of those involved in this senseless death. Now, we are told that a balloon release is expected to take place tonight in Bernard's memory. Meanwhile, police won't say whether or not he was reported missing before his body was found. We're live in West Philadelphia tonight. I'm Brian Sheehan, NBC 10 News.